Welcome, welcome to another edition of Price Check. Uh, we're going to look at some books today. Uh, this is actually, you know, people always ask me about books. This is one of the, this is a book that I had flipped at one point that really uh, opened my eyes to uh, sort of the high level of what books can do. And uh, did kind of turn me on towards these older 19th, 18th century books. Um, this one, 1926 first edition, uh, I picked mine up for, uh, I think a quarter, um, and it sold for more than this, it sold for 330, um, quite a few years ago too, so this, this value has not, uh, appreciated, which is interesting, because, you know, I've got, of course I've got my, uh, stack of, rare books uh, I'm holding on to and this is this makes me wonder if you know it might be uh, good to hold on to those a little bit longer and so we've also got here this is something I wanted to look at for folks is we've got the old man in the sea which is you know if you're doing estate sales if you're going around um, if you're looking at library discharges etc this is one to keep an eye out for. A lot of, lot of libraries will be discharging first edition uh, books like this. Actually, I think I even got one of these discharged from a, a library. And there's a big difference though. Um, this is first edition, but I believe it's like a first batch. And then, let's see, we'll go here and we'll show there's a W there. And if we go to the true first edition, which you know, makes a hell of a difference there in price, you know, if you're talking $50 versus $700, not a mistake you'd want to make as a buyer or a seller. You know, if you end up buying this one, thinking you're buying this one, that's oof. But here we've got this A, which, so this is gonna be the very first batch. This is the, the rarest one. Looks like it's in, you know, almost exactly the same condition, um, but it's just a good reminder of how important some of the details are here. Because if you're looking at these two covers, you got some sun difference there. It looks like this one looks a lot more faded. Um, I don't know if the printing's actually different, but you know, these are very similar looking books. $650 difference in price. The more you know, right? 